All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, in this video, we're doing a food review on Wiener Schnitzels. So I haven't had Wiener Schnitzels in a long ass time. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. And today we're trying their Junkyard Dog. I've never tried it before. It's gonna be my first time trying it. And if this is your first time watching my food videos, for my food videos, I give you guys my one through 10 on the taste. And I tell you guys the price. So we're gonna start off with the price. It was $5.39. After tax, it came out to five dollars and eighty-six cents, and that's kind of expensive. I only I didn't get a meal or anything like that. I just got one dog, one hot dog or chili dog, whatever it is. Come on, focus so you can see. So this better be good. Five, six dollars for a corn dog. Don't let me down, Wiener Schnitzels. Please don't let me down because to be honest, Wiener Schnitzels is Wiener Schnitzels is the only fast food restaurant that you can get a chili dog at. Am I right or am I wrong? I'm pretty sure that they're the only big, you know, like corn dog, chili dog place out there besides what's the one in the mall that we see a lot that I see a lot. I don't know why I said we well, well, of course you guys see it too. What is that shit called? Hot dog on a stick. They're just not as big. I've never seen a hot dog on a stick um drive through or anything like that. So I only see them in the mall. So in my opinion, Wiener Central has to be the biggest hot dog slash chili dog place fast food in the in the world. Craig in the world. Okay, so let's open it up. Let's see what we got right here. Enough with me talking. So it comes with onions, french fries, mustard. Is there chili in there? There's chili in there. What else is in there? And I believe that's it. So one more time. So there's onions, french fries, mustard, and chili. And then they also have the cheese inside too. So we're going to see how this shit tastes. All right. I'm going to add some more ketchup. I know they have mustard on there, but I'm going to add my own personal ketchup just because I need some ketchup on here. And it only makes sense since there's french fries on top of the chili dog. It only makes sense that I add uh, ketchup. I got a dentist appointment after this, so I cannot get dirty. I got to make sure I hold this. Let me show you. I need to get a good thumbnail, though. Look at this shit. I'm not gonna lie, it's a lot going on. There's a lot going on with this damn chili dog. But so far, so good, to be honest. Even though there's a lot going on, it's still pretty good. Um, I was just about to say they didn't give me no napkins, but they did. Let's add a little bit more ketchup take another bite but just off of the first bite alone I know I said there's a lot going on but it's actually really good I need to start going to let me put this back on top the french fry fell off I need to start going to Wiener Stenchels a lot more the only thing I don't like about Wiener Stenchels is they're kind of expensive like I said it's like six dollars for just this corn dog or chili dog whatever you want to call it six dollars for just this and that's kind of expensive if you ask me but it also tastes good and like I was saying in the beginning of the video they're the only they're the biggest what fast food restaurant that I know that serves chili dogs and corn dogs like nothing but chili dogs and corn dogs you know I wonder why they call it a junkyard dog. Well, never mind. It makes sense. It has a whole bunch of junk on it. Onions, french fries, mustard, chili, cheese. That was a dumb question I asked. All right. Well, last bite. Then I'm going to give you guys my 1 through 10 on Wiener Schnitzel's junkyard dog. Hot dog or corn dog. Hot dog. I 
I keep looking down because I'm like, hopefully I didn't get dirty. That's why if you guys are wondering why I'm eating it over the, what they came in because I'm not trying to get dirty. Right now I gotta go into the gym, get a quick workout in, and after the gym, I gotta go get my braces either taken off or change the color. Right now I have black, so. But anyways, one through 10 for Wiener Stencil's Junkyard Dog. I'm gonna give it a solid, to be honest, it tastes good. So I'm gonna give it a solid eight out of 10. So if you guys haven't tried it yet, or if you have tried it, go let me know in the comments below and let me know what you think of it. But I'm actually surprised. It had a lot going on inside, you know, on top of it, but it still tasted super good. Their french fries, their french fries are all right. They're not the best french fries in the world. But Wiener Stencils are not, they're, they're not known for their french fries. They're known for their chili dogs and their corn dogs. So, and all of all, shout out to Wiener Stencils. But this video is over. I hope you guys are having a blessed day out there. Please like, comment, and subscribe. More videos coming soon. Let's get it, baby.